Living a life of silence has been tough enough for Arthur Budzinski. He's deaf, and he's been trying to get anyone to believe his childhood story. Budzinski, speaking through his daughter Gigi, says starting at the age of 12, he was sexually abused while attending the Milwaukee St. John School for the Deaf. He hopes they do something. I believe somebody should be punished for this. He, his innocence was stolen from him. His childhood, was he was very depressed. He was not happy. He couldn't enjoy his childhood. Everything was stolen from him, and now he's 61 years old, and he's still fighting for this. But Zinsky and hundreds of others say Father Lawrence Murphy sexually abused them while attending the school. In the mid-1990s, two Wisconsin bishops urged the Vatican office led by then Cardinal Joseph Ratzinger, now the Pope, to let them hold a church trial against Murphy according to documents. But Ratzinger offered no punishment for Murphy. Well, the Pope knew about this. He was the one who handled the sex abuse cases. So I think he should be accountable because he did nothing. So members of the group SNAP, survivor network of those abused by priests, placed photos near St. Peter's Square of children accusing the Catholic Church of sex abuse, trying to get the Pope's attention. We're Catholics from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and survivors. We need to hear from him why he did what he did with the man who raped and molested children okay, in our archdiocese. We need to know why he did not let us know about him, why he didn't let the police know about him, why he did not condemn him, why he did not take his collar away from him. Church leaders at the Vatican and in the U.S. have an answer for that. They say they found out too late to deal out any real punishment. Well, I, I think had the church found out about it, and there was any evidence the church found out about it in the 60s and 70s and did nothing about it, that would be a damning story. But they didn't find out about it until 1996 when they get talking about a sick old man. Uh, what, 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 exact, what kind of justice can we give these poor people who are molested by this monster of a priest? Catholic church leaders also say the accusations and fur surrounding this and other cases are all part of a campaign to smear the Pope. Mark Carlson, The Associated Press, St. Francis, Wisconsin.